52-year-old male patient speaks in one of two word sentences. Wait a second. RR owl. Respiratory rate is 26. SpO2, 90%. Words per sentence, one of two. Difficulty breathing, well, uh, that counts as labored, I guess. Sure. What do we do? We just learned this. Now a breather mask. What could we do later on? CPAP. So here's how a lot of the National Register questions work. It's always the next step. What's the next best step that we do with the patient? You should. Well, in this question right here, I have not gotten any other vital sign besides SpO2. I also don't have lung sounds. I also don't have a patient history. I just have this. So based upon this, all I've done is walk up and put a SpO2 on the patient's finger. Right. So with this information, B is the correct answer. Now, let's say, now let's go off into, let's say, a different question. And let's say this patient here, they tried an hour breather, but this is what the patient's on and they're currently on an hour breather. What do you do, right? If the patient is speaking in one or two word sentences, that means they're awake. Then we'd go, most likely would be CPAP. Remember, we learned BVM and nasal cannula earlier, right? BVM would be if they're unresponsive. If you're speaking, if you're able to speak, then you're able to control your own airway. You're still able to speak, right? You're alert enough. Nasal cannula is for mild symptoms, right? This is not mild symptoms. So now we know how to answer these respiratory questions.